My name is Lynn Fial and today we are at RMV Studio in Stockholm. The studio that I helped build up 10 years ago, where I now work as the studio manager and in-house engineer. I think it's important to know that every instrument is unique and every instrument sounds different. So it's always a good trick to have someone play the piano and then walk around and listen to it from different angles and distances. If you have an angle where, where the piano just sounds so dreamy, just put a mic there and that might be your sweet spot. And it's not harder than that. I would first of all try to figure out what kind of piano I want, what kind of piano sound I want. If you want it mellow, if you want it really close up, if you just want it wide, narrow. Consider what kind of room you have and how that room correlates with the sound you have in mind. So now I'm just basically miking really close, a bit too close for comfort actually, because now we risk having the spectrum of the piano uneven. I also try to get the mics on a symmetrical center from the middle of the piano. And this might be too close, but then we will hear that and move them back. It can also depend on what we're playing on the piano. For this song, I also want a really dirty, charming mono sound. Um, so I'm gonna make that with this little flea market find. It's got probably no high end at all and some kind of built-in compression because the membrane and everything is so heavy. Um, so it's, it's perfect when you want it dirty. I kind of like putting mics in this area around the ears because it gives kind of the sound that you hear when you're playing the piano. So what I'm gonna do is that I will mic this glass surface. This is the muddy side of the piano. So we will get a lot of low frequency content from here. And then I'm hoping to get the top uh, off of this glass. So what I'm trying to do now is to get these mics on an equal distance from the center of the piano to achieve some sort of balance. And they're also directed against the glass. If I want it even more directed, I can use a figure of eight mic, but then I would need to turn them a bit together to aim the back lobes to the side of the piano and not get too much of the low end. Mm -hmm. 